Hi guys, it's Alyssa. Good morning. It's like 6 a.m. and I'm just sitting out on my porch just just spending some time with the Lord, waking up and um, enjoying the fresh air. <laughs> um, I just wanted to say a quick little thing today. Uh, it's talking to the Lord while I'm sitting out here and I was just talking about my my insecurities and things. I, I told him, I said, Lord, I'm embarrassed of my outside. You know, my, who I perceive myself to be. And I say perceive myself to be because that's what it is. It's not necessarily the truth, but it is how I feel others perceive me. And I just, I just was talking to God like, I really am embarrassed of who I am on the outside, like my appearance, my uh, the way I handle myself in, in in certain situations and things. I I'm kind of embarrassed of it. And the Lord said, if you're embarrassed of yourself on you know of your outside, then you're looking for men's approval. You, you're you're focusing on on man and not on God. Because he says, I'm not concerned about that. I'm concerned with your heart. He's like, yes, I do desire that you care for your body. You care for yourself, your physical self. That you take care of the, the body I gave you. And you treat it holy and you respect it. And things like that. But... He said the imperfections, he said they don't, they don't matter to him, it's your heart. And we, we've all heard this, we know that God looks at our hearts, but it was, it was just a different perspective, you know, um, him saying, if you're embarrassed of it, then, then you're looking to man and the world, um, the world's view of what you th think you should be. And God is saying, they don't matter. Get your eyes off of that. Get your eyes on God and what he, what, what his, what's important to him. And that's the heart and your spirit man. Where, where you are spiritually, where you are in your heart. Do you seek the truth of God? Do you, do you love God? Do you seek after his ways and not the ways of man and the ways of the world? Um... So I just wanted to encourage everybody with that, that it's, you know, keep your eyes on God and yes, take care of your body, take care of what he's given you, but know that he doesn't care about the imperfections. He's not looking at that. He's looking at your, your heart and your desire to, to seek after the things of God. Um, I'll probably come on later and make another video because I, I, I just feel he's has a lot to say today, but I just wanted to encourage you with that. Um, if you're dealing with your insecurities, your, your perception of how you think other people see you is negative. Um, don't focus on that. Know that God sees you and sees your heart and sees the real you. And he's working on that and he's creating the person he wanted you to be. This, the spiritual being he called you to be. Because, you know, that's who our true person is. That's our true being. That's our being of eternity. We're going, we are spirit and God is spirit. And we will be with him soon. And I think, I think that he is opening our eyes, more and more people's eyes to that, to, to get us ready to be in eternity with him. And so I think he's trying to open our eyes to that, you know, get us ready to go home with him and be with him for eternity. And we cannot enter heaven blameless, spotless, and wrinkled. We have to be pure in heart, and um, we have to be His. So, I just wanted to 
encourage you guys that God sees your heart. Don't look to please man, but look to please God in all things. Okay? Have a blessed day, and I'll probably see you guys later. Bye.